First year, we're like, we would every single night we'd go like, like in our bed crying and stuff. Like all of us first year um, players who were not from Toronto, um, we didn't really have like a family to fall back on. It was just really me and CP. Coming in here in my first year, I was I had a whole bunch of confidence and I was like, oh, I'm going to come here, I'm going to kill it, you know, be an all-star. No, 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 no. When you're in high school, you come into university and you're normally like the best player on your high school team. So then you come to university and you think, I'm good, this is, this is going to be easy. And then you realize that these girls are 21 and 22 years old, 23 even sometimes, and they're just killing you on the court. Uh, we would always talk about, like, well, talking about it now, we always go back how, like, first year we're like, we would every single night we'd go, like, like in our bed crying and stuff. Like we laugh about it now, but um, it was good because we got to connect on that level and kind of talk about it. Cause we were going through the same thing. Like she was coming from Winnipeg and I was coming from Kitchener. I mean, it's 10 times worse for her than it was for me. That kind of like was very beneficial because I knew that I had somebody to lean on. At least you know that there's, you're with somebody, you're in it together with somebody. Siki would be the person who you, I would talk to. Together they're hilarious um, to a fault sometimes, especially on the court, uh, but incredibly entertaining. You know, I would describe them more as sisters than as friends because that's exactly how they act. She's always there when I need her at all times and, you know, she's my partner in crime. We're like sisters in a sense and that bond just sort of continued out throughout our five years so far here at Ryerson. You're gonna make me cry right now. <laughs> you come so far from first year to, to now. You know, you're ranked in the CIS top 10, and it's like, you could, something that like, you could dream about. So, I think to know that those five years as a Ram is like ending, I mean, you can just be nothing but proud. We're gonna be friends forever. She's gonna be my maid of honor. I'm gonna be hers, you know? We'll definitely keep in touch and Hopefully we can stay in the same city and still ball together. <laughs> what I'm going to miss most about Siki is just knowing that <laughs> she's going to come into the team room, you know, make me laugh, annoy me, and then make me laugh again. Like, just sort of knowing that no matter what, she's always going to be there for me. No matter what, every day I'm going to see her. No matter what, every day she's going to text me or whatever the case may be. Like, to know that that may not possibly happen next year, I mean, that's sad. Definitely going to miss that girl. They clearly have a love for each other, uh, but they're also great at enjoying each other's company, laughing, making fun of each other, and, and appreciating each other. Honestly, without you, like, these five years would have not been how they were. You literally made every single second last. Um, you know, just know that I'm always going to be here for you, and that no matter what, we're going to be sisters for life. So, so I love you. Always for life. I love you, girl. Mwah.